Ah, vlog every day in April plus three days in May. Uh, it's probably like four days in May now, I think, if I checked it out correctly. Anyway, happy May. Uh, this should have ended a couple of days ago, but I started late, so we're going right into May. Uh, yeah. So if you got any questions the last day or two, um, <laughs> I'm assuming no one saw uh, the wedding debacle. But yeah, here we go. Um, going back to our good old well known as... Uh, well, not dictionary.com because I've got to use that for later on today's. But uh, UrbanDictionary.com's word of the day for yesterday was parade wave, a slight hand gesture used to wave for prolonged periods of time, like during a parade, or as a casual nonverbal greeting to friends. With the arm bent at the elbow, the waver turns the wrist back and forth, expressing the, exposing the front and then the back of the hand in a single motion. I didn't feel like talking, so I gave a quick parade wave as I walked by. That is a stupid word that they came up with. Usually Urban Dictionary has a lot better ones. This is dumb. Why do we need a parade? Why does that need to be defined? Why do we even have that? Why, If someone parade with me, I think I'd throw something at them. I wouldn't actually do that, but I'd be like, really? We're unfriend on Facebook. Nah, I probably wouldn't care enough. But I'd still be a little perturbed. I'm like, I'd be like talking to my friend. I'm like, they just, hey, you. And he goes, hey, you, did they just parade wave us? They did. <laughs> what should we do about it? Shut up. We're getting a hot dog. Yeah, that's pretty much the kind of thing that would happen. But I'd still be angry about it. Not an angry. I'd be slightly irritated. To tell you the truth. I'd be ir slightly irritated. And then I probably would get a hot dog and I'd forget about it. So... Yeah, but anyway, word of the day for psh, terrible. That's no good. Why do we have that? No. Uh, just ghost. Let's go to that one. A term meeting you're leaving, similar to out of here. I don't like those people you invited over, so I'm ghost. That's just dumb, too. Ugh, you're just disappointing me today, Urban Dictionary. Uh, let's go to the next one. Cold finger, similar to cold shoulder, except the cold finger is done by ignoring someone's text or Facebook message, usually when said person's comment is pointless or uncalled for. Man, I just got called into work for another 16-hour weekend shift. Tool, LOL, I'd never work weekends. Sit low, LOL, lol. They just got cold fingered. That just sounds dirty. Like... I don't think of, like, cold shoulder. I had someone cold finger. I just... That just sounds like a dirty, dirty thing that happened to somebody. Yeah. That's terrible. These... Freaking over three today, Urban Dictionary. Let's go to I found a good one. Screensaver? That's already a word. Uh, screensaver. The blank expression that comes across a person's face when daydreaming. Dude, check out the Dave Daydream... Check out... Cha. Dude, check out Dave daydreaming. He looks miles away. Yeah, mate, I know he has his screensaver on. That's... No. 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 Stop. No. This is just... A work sandwich. Ooh, this could be good. Back to back shifts. Uh, closing shift followed by an opening shift the next day. Primarily making a night on the town practical. I can't, man. Work sandwich. I like that one. That one actually... I'm down with that one makes that one makes a lot of sense. There's stuff going on because you got you got your work on one hand, you got your work on the other, and you're asleep in the middle. That makes a lot of sense. I'm down with this word. I mean I don't ever have to use it, but if I did, I would totally use that word. These rest of these screensaver, yeah, I use that when I'm describing my screensaver. Which who has a screensaver now? <laughs> like or just talks about it. I remember like back in the day they had the flying toasters. They'd like fly toasters, fly across. That was kind of cool back then. Yeah, but no. Parade wave. That's stupid. It's already it's already a thing. Like, someone... Like, it's a parade. It's a thing already. Uh, today's is braggadouche. Uh, a braggart is noun. A braggart, but one without the credibility to back up his or her claims. A braggadocio. Lame boasting. Mike thinks he's badass because he took home the ugly chick... At the bar, what a braggadouche. Well, to be fair, like for Mike, he did take a girl home, and you guys didn't take anybody home. 
what I'm assuming from this, what I'm assuming this, because why would you make fun of someone who took a girl home uh, if you also took a girl home? Because you wouldn't care. So this person actually, yeah, so um, these people bitching about Mike just seems like they just want to be, uh, they just want to, they just want to be, they're angry, they're jealous, because they'd not have a girl to go home with themselves. Ugh, it's a tough world we live in, guys. Tough, tough world. Alright, I think that's going to be it for today's or yesterday's or day 26. Yeah, day 26. Alright, uh, I'll probably talk to you guys in a while. I'm going to do another one for today's. And then we'll go back to our normal dictionary.com's word of the day. But instead of this bad, bad run of words on urbandictionary.com. Urban Dictionary, why have you forsaken us? Why?